If you have watched our program with any regularity, you know that we have talked about the high cost of food these days. That has prompted many in Louisiana to grow some of their own fruits and vegetables. Rather than buying at local supermarkets, some do it to save money, while others do it to relive some childhood memories. This week in Louisiana, agriculture's Taylor Fry now tells us about one retired couple who does it for a different reason, to help out their local community. Pulling weeds. They're all breaking, Kiki. Okay, well. Shoveling oh, dirt. A stump. And planting trees. This is how Ray and Linda Landry enjoy their retirement. Linda and I grew up in the time when uh, our daddies had gardens. In fact, that's how we had our fresh vegetables. This Farmer is Ray. how they get their fresh vegetables now. Ray and Linda grow 30 fruit trees and a variety of vegetables right in their front yard in St. Gabriel. They say the idea sprouted from their desire to relive their childhood. I like to think that my dad may be smiling down from heaven when he sees the fruit that I raised because of the, the life he spent 50 plus years raising sugarcane. LSU Ag Center home garden specialist Kiki Fontenot says gardening is becoming more popular. And the reason? Because people like to relive childhood memories of gardening. And it's also a way to save money. When you're a home gardener, it's more of a hobby. It's more of something that you like to do. It probably saves your neighbors more money than it saves you. And well, if you're Ray and Linda's neighbor, it pays off. I, I load up the golf cart on Saturday morning and I tour the neighborhood and usually 10, 12, 15 homes and, and what are give them out. But the sharing does not stop at their neighbors. We, we take a lot down to the um, men's shelter over at St. Vincent de Paul. And then we also take some over to the um, senior citizen shelter. What Ray says he takes from this experience is a newfound appreciation for what farmers do every day. I think the farmer is usually on the short end of the stick because when I think about what we pay for vegetables and I know what it costs to raise them, uh, I think the farmer is probably making the least amount of the profit and he's doing most of the work. So it's in retirement where the Landry's find their most rewarding work. For this week in Louisiana agriculture, I'm Taylor Fry. The LSU Ag Center offers lots of help to budding gardeners, the biggest being its Master Gardener Program. To learn more about the Master Gardener Program and how the LSU Ag Center can help you get your garden growing, you can visit our website at twilighttv.org.